That's a Dodi under the 58, and today we're going to play Doki Doki Penguin Land. Which is a really stupid name because it tries to translate as Heartbeat Heartbeat Penguin Land. It doesn't make much sense, does it? Oh, that's one stupid looking polar bear. Right, so let's start this again. This looks like an M M MSX game or a Spectrum game, how the graphics are. Right, so, yeah, I'm a, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a penguin and. What do we have to do? Right, I have to drop this egg. I have to place this. Oh. And you can't stand on the egg! Wait a minute, I've actually played this before! You can get this game on Game Boy, original Game Boy! Ah, crap. You can't, yep, yeah, this game is on original Game Boy! I thought it was so weird seeing a game on Game Boy actually by, actually by Sega! I think it's pretty much the only Game Boy game with Sega's name in it! Ah, I like that, whatever that does. Nothing at all. Job. I like it definitely had better music on the game boy. It's still very difficult and frustrating though. And like some weird version of rip off version of Lord Runner. I always hated that game because it was just a pain in the backside. To get anywhere on. Ow! You do Ah, the pot now the polar is don't kill you. Interesting. Oh that does. <laughs> yeah! And that's Doki Doki Penguin Land. I would call this the best game in the world, it's a bit too hard for my liking. I remember the Game Boy version was was pretty much stupidly difficult as well. 